And speaking of the Omicron variant, more people in the Houston area are testing positive for it. Stephanie Whitfield breaking down the differences doctors are seeing between the Omicron and Delta variants. In just three weeks, COVID-19 cases reached a new high in the Houston area thanks to the Omicron variant. That's according to the Texas Medical Center's dashboard. It took the Delta variant three times as long to reach a peak over the summer. Just the steep rise, uh, nothing like that before. I mean, the slope is, is, you know, is basically just vertical. Dr. Lauren Hopkins with the Houston Health Department says wastewater testing is showing high levels of the virus all over town. The spread shows how much more contagious the Omicron variant of COVID-19 is. Doctors at Memorial Hermann are seeing other differences too. But it is feeling a little bit different in that the patients that we're getting in the hospital are less sick. They're less likely to go on ventilators and they tend to go home uh, a little sooner. Now, this is personal experience. We're still gathering data. Dr. Linda Yancey says the symptoms of Omicron are slightly different than other versions of COVID too. The one uh, specific symptom of COVID, that loss of taste and smell, appears to be less common in Omicron. So it really does feel like every influenza you've ever had, every cold you've ever had. That's why she says it's so important to take the time to get tested so you know you have it and you can try not to spread it to anyone else. Stephanie Whitfield, KHOU 11 News.